Today is a very special day, honoring an extraordinary human being. A man who was, as I said so in the beginning of my show, not only willing to fight for what he believed in, but to die for what he believed in. And it seems like heroes like Martin Luther King are so few and far between. And we seem to be lacking in them in our lives these days. And I pray that more and more people will have the courage to stand up and fight for what they believe in. Yes. Because Martin Luther King, he achieved a lot. We, we are still fighting a lot of the same wars. We are still fighting discriminations of all kinds. Not just against people with different skin color, with different religious beliefs. Gay, straight, bi. Let's talk about discrimination against females. Started. The thing is, I don't want to stand up here and complain. What I want to do is have a moment of acknowledgement that we are as free as we think we are. Yeah. I'm not so sure that America is the land of the free and the home of the brave anymore, but a girl can dream. And Martin Luther King walked, walked, marched in front of the White House. And in 1965, when African Americans finally achieved the right to vote, we have come so far, and we have so far to go. However, we must not take our freedom for granted. And I think that we do. We live in a bubble. And we are so free that we take it for granted. And there are people all around this world, like Iran, who are killed for being gay. There are girls like... There are girls in Islamic countries who are killed for going to school. I mean, the list goes on and on. I could list the atrocities. Human beings do fucked up things to human beings. They did thousands and thousands of years ago and they still do. And I hope and pray that one day that will change. this one little story and I'm going to get on with my music I made this documentary about children who were orphaned by AIDS in Africa and I took it to the film festival in New York and this woman said to me now you have to decide whether you're going to be an artist or an activist and I said what the fuck are you talking about that's what being an artist is We shape the world around us, we reflect the world around us. 